Hello, I'm Doug DeWitt, Transfer Paper Product Manager here at Condi Systems, giving you a quick tech tip on the Laser Imprints Go Uno Color Laser Printer. Now, those clients of ours who might have this particular unit, if you look at the LED display on the Laser Imprints Go Uno, it will give you the toner life of your cyan, magenta, yellow, and black toner cartridges. And while this bar graft is convenient, we've got to understand that it's not 100% accurate. So, if you want more accurate information on the toner and other consumables inside your Laser Imprints Go Uno, the best thing to do is to print this, a configuration report from the Laser Imprints Go Uno. Let's step over to the printer and I'll show you how to do it. Now that we're at the Laser Imprints Go Uno, let's print a configuration report from the unit. The first thing you want to do is make sure that you have plain paper loaded in your cassette tray of the printer. When you're loading the plain paper, you want to load it in a landscape configuration. Close the cassette tray and make sure the flywheel indicator is set to letter size in a landscape format. Next, let's go to the menu commands of our Laser Imprints Go Uno. Make sure your LED display says ready to print and that the ready light is indicated. Next, you want to press the menu key, which is the up arrow, to get to the functions menu. We're going to press the down arrow once to highlight print information and then press the enter key. Next step, make sure configuration is highlighted in print information and again, press the enter key. At that point, it should highlight execute. Press the enter key one more time and the Laser Imprints Go Uno will print out the configuration report. Okay. And now we have our two page configuration report from our Laser Imprints Go Uno. Let's analyze the information produced on this report so that you can get a better understanding of why it is so important to you. The first piece of vital information in the configuration report is the tray count, the number of prints that have been through both your cassette and multi-purpose tray. The next vital piece of information is the supply life of the consumables inside of the printer. As you can see here, it gives you a percentage measurement of the life of your cyan, magenta, yellow, and black drums, the OPC belt, and the fuser section as well as your cyan, magenta, yellow, and black toner cartridge. As you can see by this percentage information, it is much more accurate than the LED display from the Laser Imprints Go Uno. The next piece of vital information is the network information. Note the IP address listed for this particular printer. So if you need to network this unit, you can figure out what your IP address is at the moment and change it if necessary by going through the menu on the Laser Imprints Go Uno. Next piece of vital information is the system information, especially the serial number, which is printed here. If you ever need to contact us for technical support, it's always a good idea to reference the serial number of your particular unit. The next piece of vital information on this report is the menu section. It shows how your particular Laser Imprints Go Uno is configured. So if you want to make any changes through the menu of your Laser Imprints Go Uno, here you have your starting settings, and whenever you make a change and print another configuration report, the information will change so that you can keep track of the changes that you make to your particular unit. Here on the second page of our configuration report, the main information to look for on this page is the calibration of the printer. Because on the Laser Imprints Go Uno, not only can we change the density of the toner output for all four colors, but we can change each individual color. If any changes have been made to your Laser Imprints Go Uno, it will be documented on this second page of your configuration report. So this concludes my tech tip on the Laser Imprints Go Uno, the configuration report. Remember the vital information that's produced from this configuration report. Every time you print one, keep it in a file, keep it handy. Every time you change a consumable inside your Laser Imprints Go Uno, print a configuration report, note the changes in the report, 
And by keeping track of these changes, you can build accurate business models so that you can calculate your exact cost of operation on this unit. I hope this tip helps. Make sure you tune in to more tech tips on the Laser Imprints Go Uno. Until then, I'm Doug DeWitt, Transfer Paper Product Manager here at Condi Systems. My time is up, and I thank you for yours.